<laughs> Great decision by Dark Horse, yeah. getting him in his zone where he really has to urinate. Well, Dark Horse also has a 42 ounce of OE. And Dark is taking That's the fourth port, really asserting his dominance in this match so far. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Falcon Dez. I think you might be an alcoholic. <laughs> Wait, so you Shut guys up, are Brad. in the right port. Sorry. All right, so we got Narwhals, Black Falcon. Sorry, African American Falcon. Yeah. And oh, we're starting early. We're not doing any no of this uh, no neutral bullshit. And wow, that second uh, that second uh, up air uh, hit. He had a, he did, I think he had a fast fall before that. Um, like the end of that second hit in air was a little scary. And great shield jump from the ledge there. I, I kind of like keeping track of like the options that they're using from the yeah. ledge. See, uh, I, I don't want to like what? say anything too loud with them like next to us. I don't want to. Thought he could have wow. nared in the foul kick with that up smash. Sixty nine, the magic percent. Yeah, so just missed tech there, and Dark gets up and jabs. Don't know if that jab was uh, on purpose or not, and that'll be the stock. Yeah, this is, dude, especially with this four stock when we have Falcon yep. games, man, these games are going to, oh, that, wow. was, a, that was a nice option now. What? <laughs> How did and course he, get back there? That was, a, that was a frame perfect hop off the ledge. I like I like these, like, bears uh, that Narwhal does. Yeah, and hug. wants. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, it's all, yeah, the Falcon Cake's always, like, real close with that, uh, and we got ourselves a nice standard to bring back, but you got it when you're down 3-1, uh, yeah, you got standards it. galore, 2-1, I'm telling just you, these four-stock games there. are too, they're too fast for Falcon did us, and wow, I think he was gonna up air that, and he still got caught with that, and he thought he was going to top flat. Dark Horse the most unorthodox Falcon of all time. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> and that's and another standard we call move. that the dunk. The dunk. <laughs> it's also dumb. It's Stop also, listening to my commentary. It's also the scrub. Wow, and Dark Horse could steal this one. And did he jump? No, he did not. So you just got to get it. And... He actually good option to go right and he doesn't he misses the back air um, and gets that jump back somewhere, I don't know. And That's yeah, gonna if he's gonna roll on stage, Dark just comes back, back throws. I feel like not talk strategy in it at all. I don't know. <laughs> not that you guys are taking any advice from me, but This is the worst this is the worst like D one pool. It's these two, Star King and Hammerheart all together. Really? That's funny. Oh, Narwhal. We get the counter pick by the Dude, Dirty the Kirby. Thing. This is a classic matchup. Kirby's have been killing Falcons for centuries. And just quick grab. Hey, why not? I feel like back throws may be a better option at like real low percent. Well, I mean, almost at any percent. Unless it's going to kill Kirby exactly. back throws. Yeah. Better. But um, I don't even know what just happened. I mean, they're pretty good to like get uh, off the ledge, uh, like because like the fact that Falcon gets turned around from it, and Narwhal just saying, "Come into my up tilt." Kirby looking real good. Yeah. Man, you should just went Kirby first. <laughs> and I mean, yeah, everyone should just always be Kirby. Dark's gonna fast fall into this. And no yeah, jump. use the jump. Yeah, Narwhal knew. Dark didn't know. I did not know. I did not see that at all. Uh, great, uh, oh, great awareness. And wow, that up to. God, this matchup's dumb. Yeah, moral of the story: Kirby up tilt's really good. As Isaiah said, don't run into pivot up. Yeah, throws. man, so wise. <laughs> <laughs> And yeah, that little, that little, uh, uh, he definitely, I think he wanted a downer. Quick four stock from Narwhal, so. 
Yeah, it does Narwhal. Stay Kirby or go Luigi. <laughs> no, don't do it. <laughs> All I want to see is a Luigi and DK. It's all right. Don't be a hero. <laughs> Narwhal, I'm pretty sure at Let's Go for like teams, I was just like, hey, man, post in the Luigi group. You got to go Luigi now. And he just went Luigi and just lost. <laughs> yeah, that was like before I even really knew him, so I kind of felt bad. Ooh, Puff, I think. All right, so he's, yeah, here we go. Zombie Puff. So this match will take probably twice as long as the previous two combined. For sure. You know the game, uh, I like to describe this matchup, you know, when they put the hands down and you have to like go like that, <laughs> that's this matchup, just fighting for, uh, ooh, and, and it's definitely, if, if, if Kirby's going to sit there and up tilt, uh, Jake's can definitely like kind of wait it out sometimes, and then, um, come down with drill. Yeah, yeah, and basically just kind of wait, wow, like you just delay the drill. I wonder what the over-under is on whether or not we should see a shield break. I think it's pretty tough with Kirby on Puff. Yeah, See, that's what I'm talking. That's what I'm talking about there, where he if and he's he gonna he cancel, pops him up, but like off it's that like really your best option him. though for Kirby is not even to like stand there and up till and yeah. just play that battle and it's just run away and get get up top then. So like, <laughs> so it looks weird like up smash. it looks like uh yeah nah. the up smash but is so good yet yeah, has the weirdest. Uh, the weirdest hitbox in the front. It's like way more powerful in the back. <sighs> Tries to just sneak an up air in there at zero. And good back air. Trades with the down air, but that'll do it. Ooh, Ooh nice right little weave. Edge. Bob and weave, bob and weave. And. Oh, I'm pretty sure he could have got a rest combo with that. The, uh, with a, yeah, with, with that, the forward throw, low. right? Yeah. I thought so, yeah. Like one aerial, you are you can you can up throw after yeah. one aerial, I thought. But I don't know if he knows that, so let's not say it too loud. All right, but here we go. We have a three-stock game. As of lately, I've been thinking, I think Puff is the worst matchup for Kirby. I don't know if you agree, but, like, I don't think Pika. Um, I think it's, like... Over Pika? Yeah, I think Pika has to work so much harder than um, Kirby does in the Pika Kirby matchup, and like I feel like I feel like this matchup, I think it's so much more mentally stressful for a Kirby. Like where I think Kirby has like the frame data advantage, I feel like player-wise. Um, wow, that's recorded. I don't know. I feel like it's pretty tough. I feel, I feel like it's like pretty Kirby's tough to always, get in. Kirby's always afraid. Like no matter what percent they are, like they can die. Whereas like they're normal. I, okay, up okay, I see what you mean when you say work. Like uh, it's not like Pika has any combos that are gonna kill at like 50. Like that. And yeah, the rest that yeah, but still he had however much for seven. Right. But like. Ooh, nice weak nair into forward smash. But he's just as vulnerable right now that he was at 150 percent, right? And like Kirby up tilt, stupid like brainless combos will work on Pikachu, will not work on Puff. So. Okay, you know what? I didn't agree with you when you started, but you're kind of making some valid points. Um, that being said, I still think this is like a cancerous matchup and to watch and play. Well, not watch, but to play. It's like mentally exhausting, but I think it's, yeah, it's again, just as in taxing. A way, in a way, it's almost like a... Uh, like a game of like stubbornness in a yeah. way to, for like for, for for at least when you have the uh like who's Ooh. aerial and yeah we're we're all learning <laughs> and he just he just does a down b there had to have been a wow better kills option. off the top yeah. normal takes that would be it no it's only it's best of five. Oh, that's right oh man it's best of five apparition oh, thought the series was over but we are just getting started so both these Falcon mains, um... So Narwhal saying he does not want to Falcon Ditto again. The cowardice choice. And do you think if he goes Falcon, does Dark go Falcon? Yeah, I liked his Yoshi yesterday in the crew battle. I, I would like to see that again. But I, I do feel that both Dark's Falcon and 
Jinx could. Um, it looks like he was hovering over Yoshi. Ooh, dark, dark telling him that he lost to a Yoshi. Ooh. Maybe he in like some it. reverse mind games where like he wants him to go Yoshi. But did he really? Did he really lose to him? I wonder. Is it a, just a complete yeah, elaborate yeah. bait? I think they should just go. He random. could always go. He could always go Luigi versus uh, Puff. Yeah. Luigi versus Puff. I like. I still like. Ooh. And we do. He counterpicks the polygon Yoshi. <laughs> and we got Yoshi Falcon. I love this matchup. Yeah, Polygon Yoshi is uh, mid tier. Like within the entire cast. Oh, uh, just misses the yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, actually, I would agree with that. And oof, Dark is getting these uh these up smashes out of shield are real nice. That's and one quick one. And maybe wanted a down B instead of neutral B, but I think he still would have got back aired anyway. Yeah, dude, up, sm up smash at shield is really working versus these. Uh, Ooh, wow, just powers tilt. through that, gets the uh, gets the F air, and that down beat's gonna kill. Yeah, could have had that reverse ledge. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I love that's so pretty. Uh, I don't know, that really gets me off. <laughs> yeah, it was definitely too high uh, with the up up air, but sometimes you can just kind of catch them. Great weight on that. Yeah. On that forward air, I totally would have went for a move way earlier. He just, he just, no rush, dude. No rush. You know he's gonna attack. Narwhal knows. And back air just breaks it enough. That's so to keep sad him away. when it breaks like right at the edge there. Yeah. I'm just like, no. Oh, and the like the turnaround. And dark, dark getting some of his uh, smashes in. And it was a good. Uh, it was a good fast fall with the back air to get himself back on stage, but then he, uh, he accidentally rolled. Gets that forward tilt into uh it's so fun to watch. Oh, he thought he was going to go to the ledge, and then he actually lands on stage with the fair. Um, couldn't follow up after, and Dark brings it back to last stop. Uh, That oh, the jab is just so risky. Oh, what is this? I, I don't know if he had a jump after that either, dude. That was crazy. Oh, and man, that up smash, he had no armor. That was like <laughs> pretty scary. Dude, this whole dude there's so right many trades in this last. <laughs> oh, my, oh god. my god. And this. Yeah, two. And he was too high, too too high for the Falcon Punch, wow. and then he kind of just like was just like, what do I do? Oh my god, that was a fun set. Though. Yeah, that All was a crazy. Fun match. Glad I grabbed one of these cold ones. Gonna need another one soon.